Okay, we're at 14823 25th Avenue East, Tacoma, Washington. It's about quarter to 8 a.m. in the morning. Neighborhood has good pride of ownership. You have a sunken living room here, wood fireplace, along with access to put, bring in your wood. This is currently a wood fireplace. I would probably put in an uh, air type type stove, a high efficiency. That's what I would do. Now, going on into the kitchen and dining room area, carpet is in very good condition. Oh, I'm going to go back and shut the door. It's your front door. Rainy, a little bit cold outside. kitchen is a decent size you have good uh, storage area the uh, flooring is in very good condition it's kind of a hardwood type flooring can't really tell exactly what brand it is as you can see there's been a lot of showings where this uh, house is in very good condition all the windows have been upgraded to your modern dual pane going off here into what could be the family room with the uh, slider out to the back nice size backyard nice big patio It's raining and I'm in my stocking feet, so I'm not going out with this filming. And the sill pictures pretty much highlight the backyard anyways. You do have popcorn ceiling, probably original. Nice roomy two-car garage. You got natural gas hot water heater and furnace okay the uh, pass through for wood for the fireplace has been blocked off so right now that's just for show Okay, let's go in the back of the house. Walking through the kitchen, going back to the bedroom area. Bathroom does have a skylight, which is really handy in this area. does get kind of dark here during the winter Off to bedroom number one granted yeah it's purple but paint is cheap and again the carpet is not in good condition here a little bit worn but not bad bedroom number two Got something going on up here. Kind of an indentation. Looks like the wall board may have fallen down a little bit. If our offer is accepted, we would want to have that checked out. Bedroom number three, which is the master bedroom, in good condition. Master bedroom's a three-quarter bath. They have the same hardwood flooring all the way through the house. Uh, 
upgraded windows in here as well linen closets Got some more closets over here And that concludes the tour. Oh, I wanted to check the uh, big window. The big window has been upgraded as well. This house has been well maintained. This is a keeper. A little bit of wear on the parquet flooring down here. Nothing to be too concerned of. Coat closet. Okay, now for the uh, neighborhood, I'll take a few more shots outside as well. All right, try this again. Uh, the streets mostly ramblers. All the yards are well maintained. <clears throat> Not seeing any junk vehicles or anything like that. Nice mature neighborhood. You got these, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, these uh, little speed bumps as you go through. Nice big yards. Oh, look out for the squirrels. The uh, houses had, uh, there were 26 business cards inside the house when I visited this morning. Uh, took some pictures of the uh, soffit underneath and all that looks really in good condition. The uh, corners of the house, there's a little bit of a drainage problem in the one corner. I took some close-up shots of that. Um, there's a little bit of rot up there, but not a lot. So, uh, one of the things you're going to want to take a look at is the, um, the uh, gutter system, the drainage system. And how you might want to improve on that doesn't have standard type gutters on it and that might be the issue another speed bump here people let me go by nice and polite got someone behind me pull over them pass. The interior of the house was in good condition. The uh, fireplace uh, is a wood fireplace. We want to have that inspected. Uh, although uh, this day and age uh, an airtight wood stove and insert would be uh, probably a good plan. And when they do the insert they uh, run a separate stack, a new stack up through the fireplace. And so it uh, keeps the integrity of the fireplace and there's no uh, real... Uh, the existing fireplace and the flue really don't have a lot to do with the, um, the chimney. You know, the fire and the smoke going out. Got another guy behind me. Pull over, let him pass, or her, the GMC.
drivers seem pretty polite here. I think that's a pretty good indication of the neighborhood. The houses, this whole street is in really nice condition. Okay, I'm gonna go up here to the stop sign. Turn around, go back the other way, one side street. Actually, this road circles around. I uh, remember seeing this gal in the red walk by earlier. She's out for her morning walk. ramblers as well. All the yards are well maintained. Granted it's a little bit of a gray day which is typical for Seattle this time of year. That's why you see a lot of us like to go to sunnier places during the winter for vacation. We get lonely for the sun. Get some of that vitamin D. You know, I'm noticing all the roofs on the houses are well taken care of. I'm not seeing a lot of pine needles and debris on top of the roofs. And there, as you can see, driving around, there are quite a few big pine trees. And so this is another indicator that the houses are taken care of. This is a nice neighborhood. Okay, here we are back on 25th Avenue. area signing off